I've played quite a lot of real people. It does carry a special responsibility. What I've always felt about the way, not just myself, but the way other people in the play were cast, is that we've been cast as if we would make a very good shadow for the real person. If you took a picture of, you know, the five main royals, if you took a picture of their shadows and a picture of our shadows, I don't think there'd be a huge amount of difference. So that's the first thing, you know, you're cast sensibly. I'm not being asked to play something crazily beyond my brief. Somebody said to me, have you done a lot of research? Well, I don't have to because we've lived our lives in parallel. You know, he's always been in the public eye. As I've grown up, you know, I've just watched him go through various phases of his life. Just in terms of imitating, we decided that it was very much not what was required. But just occasionally, I did a little bit to say, this is who you're watching, you know, don't forget who this is. Famously, he does this with his signet ring and also does that with his cuffs. And he pulls his mouth down to the side when he's talking, you know. Doesn't really open his mouth, he just talks like that. Politically, our sway and influence are in decline. But endless people said to me how like Charles I looked. Actually, I don't. And I think because we weren't doing too much impersonation, the audience were free to take their image and plant it onto us. I've been doing it for so long now, I think I'm probably doing some of it without even being aware, you know. It's just my other, my other self now.